Hello, my dear student. I welcome you all to the math class. So, in today's class, we will be doing question number one from exercise 3.4, which is in page number 59 of your maths NCRT book. So, the first question says that find the common factors of number A, 20, and 28. So, the question is very easy. In our pre in your last class during the introduction of this chapter, I have told you how to find what are the factors we have we have in one number starting from one, right? So similarly here, we will first of all find out the factors of each number. Then we will relate the common factors and the whatever are the common factors that is the matching one, we will write down here. Okay, so let's do without wasting any time. Number A is 20 and 28, right? So we have to first of all write uh, the factors of 20. What will be the factors of 20? The factors of 20 will be starting from 1. Yes. Then the second number will be 2. 2 tens are 20. Then 3 cannot divide 20. 4 can divide. Yes. 5 can divide. 4 5 are 20. Then the next number will be 6 cannot divide. 7 cannot divide. 8, 9, 10. Right. And directly we have is 10, 20. 1 into 20, 2 tens are 20, 4 fives are 20, 5 fours are 20, 10, ones, uh, 10 twos are 20, and 20 ones are 20, right? So, this will be the, these are the many factors, all the factors of 20, starting from 1. Similarly, we will write the factors of 28, the factors of 28 starting from 1, right? 1 28 is a 28, 2 14 is a 28 3 cannot divide 4 6 is a 24 4 can divide 4 7 is a 28 so 4 7 is a 28 uh, so 7 i can write directly because 5 and 6 cannot divide uh, 8 cannot divide 9 cannot divide 10 cannot divide 11 so next uh, directly we have is 14 because 2 14 is uh, 28 next we have is 28 so these are the many factors of 28 and this many other factors of 20. So I will uh, <clears throat> now what I'm going to do is we have to find therefore they have said us to write down the common factors. Sorry. Common factors of 20 and 28. Common means the one which number is repeated in both the factors say 1 is in both the case so the common factors of 1 20 and 28 is 1 next we have is 2 is repeated in both the case yes you can see uh, 4 is there so I can write here 1 2 4 then next we have is um, 14 uh, okay so this 1, 2, 4 are the factor, common factors of 20 and 28. So you can see no other numbers are repeated, right? No other numbers are repeated. So hence, we will consider 1, 2, and 4 are the common factors of 20 and 28. So student, in this manner, we will now next proceed to question number B, that is to find the common factors of 15 and 25. So the next question we have is number B. 15 and 25 so same method we are going to apply here so what are the factors of 15 let's write that factors of 15 the factors of 15 starting from 1 1 15 ja, right then comes this 3 5 ja, 15 don't jump directly into the bigger number as because um, if you do so you will get confused okay so that's why one starting from 1 you start as because 1 is a common factors of every number 1 is a factors of every number, 1 15 is a 15, then comes 3 5 is a 15, then uh, 4 cannot divide, 5 can divide, right? So 5 3 is a 15, then our next number will be 6 7 cannot divide, so directly 15. Because 1 15 is 15, and 3 5 is 15, and 5 3 is a 15. There are no other factors in between that, right? So similarly, factors of 25 will be starting from 1, 1 25 is a 25. Um, 3 cannot divide so 5 5 is a 25 uh, so 5 5 is a 25 and 25 1 is 25 
so from here now we have to choose the common factors common factors means you have to get the number which are getting repeat, uh, repeated common factors of 15 and 25 are starting from 1 1 is a common factor in both the case similarly 5 here you can see are repeated so 1 and 5 no other numbers are repeated 3 can 3 you cannot see in a in uh, 3 as a factor of 25 25 is not the factor of uh, 15 or 15 is not the factor of 25 so hence we can consider therefore the common factors of 15 and 25 are 1 and 5 okay so let's do the next one so here we have part c 35 and 50 so first of all what we are going to do is we are going to find the factors of 35 similarly how we did so 135 ja, yes 3 cannot divide so 5 7 ja, 35 and 7 5 ja is 35 next directly 35 because no other number is there in between which can divide 35 so now factors of 50 1 can divide yes 2 25 ja is possible um, 3 cannot divide 4 cannot divide 5 can divide 5 10 ja is 50 then comes 10, uh, 6 cannot divide, 7, 8, 9, 10 can divide, 10, 5, j. then we have directly is 2 into 25, yes, then in between I think there is no other number which can divide, so directly 50, so the common factors, common factors of 35, common means the number which are common in both the case, that is 1 here is common, so let me choose then another pen 1 comma okay 1 um, you can see 5 in both the case right so 5 is a common number next uh, no other numbers are there you can see here that no other numbers are repeated so only 1 and 5 are repeated so that's why we will consider common factors of 35 are 1 and 5 okay so this is the way of solving the questions so now the part d you can do it yourself i guess so i will keep this for you i want you all to do it yourself okay so now let's proceed to the next question the next question here we have is part question number two from exercise 3.3.4 okay so question state that number to find the common factors of 4 8 and 12 so similarly here also we are going to apply the same method so the question is 4 8 and 12 now here also we will one by one find the factors what are the factors of 4 the factors of 4 are factors of 4 starting from 1 then 2 2 to the 4 uh, then 4 1 the 4 there are no other factors right similarly factors of 8 are 1 8 1 8 the 8 2 4 the 8 4 2 the 8 and 8 1 the 8 similarly now next number we have is factors of 12 we have to find so 1 12 the 12 2 6 the 12 3 4 the 12 right 4 3 the 12 then comes 12 1 the 12 so now you can see here the uh, what we have to do here is we have to find the common factors so the common factors of 4 8 12 4 8 and 12 are so one are, one is common in all the number all the three number starting from one two is also common in all the number then four is also common right and uh, this is this is all 1 2 and 4 are the common factors of 4 8 and 12 All right, so one more uh, number will be common factors here. That is It will be 6 right and then 12 Okay, so because 2 6 is 12. So I forgot to mention that don't worry, but still 6 is not uh, Is not repeated in other 4 and 8. So that's why the factors will be 1 2 and 4 only okay so student number b i will leave it for you i have done very much similar questions in the previous question number one as well as this question number 2a so number b i will leave for you all 
you will do it yourself okay okay let's do question number 3 now question number 3 state that find first three common multiples of 6 and 8 so common multi multiples you all know what is that it's a normal table of 6 and 8 from there what we have to do is we have to find the first three common multiples all right first three common multiples okay so let's write for number 6 let's do for question number 6 and uh, question number a 6 and 8 so we have to write the multiples of 6 first the multiples of 6 are 6 one the 6 6 two the 12 6 three the 18 Six four to twenty four, six five to thirty, six six to thirty six, six seven to forty two, six eight to forty eight, six nine to fifty four, then six ten to sixty. Okay, so this is the table: six one to six, six two to twelve, six three to eighteen, twenty four, thirty, six six to thirty six, six seven to forty two, six eight to forty eight, six nine to fifty two, six ten to sixty. So this is the multiples of six. right multiple these are the multiples of 6 now similarly what we are going to do we are going to find the multiples of 8 8 1 to 8 8 2 to 16 8 3 to 24 for 8 4 to 32 8 5 to 40 8 6 to 48 8 7 to 56 8 eight to 64 8 eight to 64 8 9 to 72 and 8 10 to 80 so 8 1 to 8 8 to 16 8 3 to 24 Eight four to twenty four for eight four to thirty two eight five to forty eight six to forty eight eight seven to fifty six eight eight to sixty four eight nine to seventy two eight ten to eighty. So this is these are the multiples of eight. So now in between this, what are the common multiples? So let's find out. Therefore, the common. Therefore, the common multiples. Common multiples of six and eight are are. So let's uh, let's get started in finding. So twenty four is getting matched. Okay. So they have said only first three multiples, right? So let's do that only. So forty eight is getting matched. Okay. Then, uh, okay, sixty four. Any number is getting matched? Do you think? Mm. So I cannot see any other number. So what I'll do is I'll little extend the multiples of six. Okay, six ten is sixty, six eleven is sixty six, and six twelve is seventy two. Now I can find the multiples of seventy two. Uh, sorry, multiples of uh, in the multiples of six I can find the common multiple that is seventy two. So here, uh, here I am going to write seventy two. So these are the common multiples, three common multiples of si common multiples of six and eight, right? So student, if you uh, don't find till in between ten, then little bit proceed as because we have to find the three common multiples. So according to the questions, three common multiples should be mentioned. Okay, so I forgot to write here. Here one thing should be written that is three common multiples of six and eight are twenty four, forty eight, and seventy two. Okay, so if suppose there was four more common multiples, then you you your work is to extend the multiples. Yeah, multiples of eleven, eight, six, and eight. So in this manner, let's solve number B also. Number B is. So in order to solve this, you need to know the table of twelve. That is the multiples of twelve. So multiples of twelve are twelve one to twelve, twelve two to twenty four, twelve three to thirty six, twelve four to forty eight, twelve five to sixty, twelve. Six j is seventy two. Twelve seven j is eighty four. Twelve nine j is hundred and eight, and twelve ten j is one hundred and twenty. Right. So. Okay. So uh, let me check whether uh, I missed any part. Twelve one j twelve. Twelve two j twenty four. Twelve three j thirty six. Twelve four j forty eight. Twelve five j sixty. Twelve six j seventy two. Twelve seven j eighty four. Twelve nine j hundred and eight, and twelve ten j is. One hundred and twenty. Okay. Now, our next step is to find the multiples of eighteen. So, what are the multiples of eighteen? Multiples of eighteen are eighteen one j eighteen, eighteen two j thirty six, eighteen three j is fifty four, eighteen four j is seventy two, eighteen five j is ninety, eighteen six j is hundred and eight. Eighteen seven ja is one hundred and twenty six. Eighteen eight ja is one hundred and forty four. 
18 9 is 162 and 18 10 is 180 so 18 36 54 72 90 108 26 126 144 18 9 162 18 10 180 right so these are the multiples of the number 12 and 24 similarly now what we are going to do we have to find the common multiples right common multiples means the number which are common in both the case so therefore let me choose the different color three common multiples of 12 and 18 are so first one we have is um, 72 in both the case we can find this 72 next we have is 108 okay and i think one more number i'm missing here is that is 36 yes 36 is the number so instead of writing directly so let me write first of all 36 as because it is the smallest one and this comes earlier right then comes 72 and comes 108 so these are the three common multiples of 12 and 18 all right students so in this manner we have to solve the given question now using the multiples and find the common multiples as well as the common factors okay so in our next class we will proceed with the next question till then stay safe and healthy thank you everyone